Hey my youth, you know where you watch Dance Hours Killer Yeah, what about my people? Dance Hours Killer there again Man as I respect each and every one Hey people First up, I'm going to present uh, a video to you And in this video, a female talked about uh, at least two persons One of those persons, she said is her mother Based on some words that the female said in this video, I got the understanding that uh, she said that she had been molested by someone. And you might be surprised to hear what the female said her mother told her. The people, based on some words that uh, this person said in this video, I feel certain ways. And I know that there are some persons who might be going through some things in life. And might not even want to say to anyone or so forth. So, to hear someone say these words in this video, I would like to say to each and every one, please, don't take the words that this person said lightly. And please, have a hope, mind and heart to what the person said in this video. Some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised for this video. Observe. If I want to name her, she go by. See there? Polly. That I want to name them. That I want to statement where she gave. The police then. A couple years ago, she locked me up. Said how much me, me broke in her house. I'm damaged her things them. Me get locked up and I'm be a jailhouse. Me end up going to court. I'm a win that case there. The judge says, say, me not have trouble her. She not satisfied. She come back now, and her baby father, the whole of them, because what? Me start post at the age of thirteen. My mother moving a man in an house by the name of Shumai. The man molests me. When me tell my mother about it, my mother look at me and tell me, say, see her father used to fuck her when she younger. And she, if she not then, me can leave it out. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now because me a post and me a talk, they must send all kind of shit. See that? She claims that she has paid tax for the land where she lives on. So she need me to come off of her land and see tax paper here where she said, when me at one point did I help her appear. See it here? When me at one point did I help her appear. If I choose me live in the yard, I drag your money towards it at one point. All right, then everything go downhill. We should not see Sarah enough is enough now. I full time for come out. You understand? I'm a target, I'm going to go to the station. I'm not, the police, them don't have a man be a police station. I got tired for some of the Come, I'm going to go down there and I'm going to lay a report of all. The things them where they the people treat them way, but what they must send our baby father send how much me not know when they might come to Jamaica and where they go come to me, and it's not like me interfering with them. Me have a shop, me come work my shop seven o'clock every morning. Me even make a kitchen to the shop just because me no want to interfere with them up there so for them tell them like, I come down here so 7 o'clock every morning I get my daughter ready I come down here so I look more breakfast down here so I look more dinner down here so me reach up back up my house by some. the latest 12 o'clock every night I have a sponge in the shop when my kids are asleep until I'm ready I have a friend here sometimes he help me lock up and he help me with the pit names struggle go up and my mother been doing me these things and she go like so she innocent to everything and she walk on and she tell people pay a lie she got she work place and she tell people pay a lie so me said no it's full time for me come out and talk all the things that when me been going through from the age of 13 till now and because me i do it now everybody i go up in a them feeling and my stepfather i go make me know say if you see me post back nothing upon tiktok where him i go do me so me post it for everybody mm -hmm. in the world see it and know say if me dead tomorrow morning mm -hmm. my mother go by the name of diane our parlance my stepfather by the name of Dwight. In brother by the name of Sean. In my dead tomorrow morning, I don't know who killed me. You hear what I say? 
Yes, because they send them threat what them are going to do and what them not going to do. I'm going to upload it and make people see, make the world world see and know. Now, listen to what me are saying now, people. See? First of all, I would like to hear where those persons that the female talk about have to say. Yeah, I would like to hear what they have to say. You see me? I say, yeah, I, I saw me stay. See? Me, even though me hear that side yeah, of the story, I want to hear what them have to say too. Because that situation, yeah, me not take a situation like this, like this lightly. You see? There's a part that the female mentioned where it leaked nerve. It's like she said that her mother said certain things. But I don't want to repeat. And let me tell you something. It's not the first time me hear a female say that her mother said some words. Not exactly the same, but somewhat similar. So me I wonder, it made me wonder what really and truly are going to Jamaica. You understand me? But anyways, I present this video to you to help bring an awareness and to hear some words that the person said in that video. Alright? Let me know what I think, my people. If you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a video. Now, I'm going to present a video to you that's going to show some things that happened during a confrontation between two persons. In the video, you can hear more than one person using Jamaican accent to talk. I don't have any confirmed information as to exactly where and when the video will be recorded. However, I got the understanding that uh, the confrontation escalated to a point where at least one of those persons threw objects at the other person. And it is believed that the person threw the objects with the intention to hurt that person during subscribers. In my point of view, I think that the confrontation escalated even more when one person was behaving more aggressive towards the other person and the person was also holding at least one object. The person also pushed the person as well to interview the subscribers. I find a situation like that to be dangerous, my people. However, I read comments on social media about the situation that gave me the understanding that there are some persons who found the video and the situation to be amusing while there are some who do not find a situation like that amusing. But people, for you to get a better understanding as to what I'm talking about, here I'm going to present the video to you. And please bear in mind that this video shows some things that happened when one person threw objects at someone. So, before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised for this video. Observe. You see the dangerous situation we are talking about? The word if came to my mind based on some of the things I'm going to see. If I mean, they want to, to spell everything out. It's set away, really, and look away. So I find that situation to be dangerous, and I'm not trying to be disrespectful to anyone. But it's just some comments that I've made on social media that really and truly have me wondering what some people are think. Because I do not find that situation amusing. I find that situation dangerous. See? So, my people, tell me where you think might be right and where you think might be wrong when it comes down to that situation. In my point of view, yeah, I see where one person was more wrong than the other, but I think both of those persons are at fault. I got information that a crocodile was found and captured at a river that's located within the country of Jamaica. The crocodile said to have been removed from the river. 
See? And we read quite a number of comments on social media about uh, the situation and so on during subscribers. See? Listen to the thing about it is now, see? Because some of the comments gave me the understanding that there are some persons who basically do not agree with uh, human beings, as so to put it, capturing crocodiles from what they call the crocodile's natural habitat. And there are some of the comments that gave me the understanding that there are some persons who agree with the crocodile being removed from that part of the river. I also got the understanding that there's an allegation that uh, the crocodile might be relocated. You understand me? However, now my people, before we get to certain details, I'm going to read some of the comments then, and I'm going to read from a news article about a situation where they said that uh, um, a crocodile that is said to be of a certain amount of feet have been found at a river in Jamaica. But here is my opinion. See, this is not the first time I got information about uh, crocodiles being found and are captured at locations within the country of Jamaica. Notice I said locations. So upon getting those type of information, I start to take caution when it comes down to going to rivers and the beach to swim. So there's a, because the amount of information we get about certain type of animals we found in the beach and certain crocodiles at river and all them things, then I said, no, 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 no. I don't think it is wise for me if you just go out of the river and say, hey, me, I go swim, I don't know what day in a hit. So I said, here's a question I'm going to ask. See? So it is said that a crocodile was found and captured and removed from a part of the river that's located in Conja, Jamaica, right? How long have that uh, animal been in that river before someone realized that animal did here? So, see? How long? Here's another question. How many more are there? Here's another question. Is it good for the environment to remove the animal from their natural habitat? I don't think it is good for the environment to be doing certain things. You understand me? So therefore, I think it is best. Well, me don't know what about this, but me would have still them. Wait. So here's a comment from someone that said the crocodile is sick. Believe me. I think that that person that might have found the situation I'm using. So man said, all right. And then a comment from someone said, the thing is, Nepa is not doing a good job uh, for controlling them and they are popping up in every river it's becoming dangerous to swim in places we grow up swimming in Nepal controlling them like all right my people they never, they never say much more about that because that, that part they really and truly they have me thinking another comment from someone said the brother will say arrest him i think that the person they might have found it um amusing the people see okay so here's a comment from someone that said this morning i was talking about it it's so a uh, s word me now say humans belong on land the crocodile is in its habitat and when they capture it and give it to any pa i'm going to say nepa they are gonna sell the animal to be caged up in a zoo or released elsewhere in another river and there's another s word i'm not gonna say as um another comment from someone said they're gonna eat him. all right me leave out that part there right there so that's a comment i'm gonna really um all right so another comment from someone said until someone's kid gets eaten nope Drag him out and get rid of him. I don't want you getting eaten. And uh, there are more comments there, my people. See? So, them comments are really and truly have me thinking, you know. There are some people who don't agree with the animal being removed from what they call natural habitat. And there are some who agree with it being removed. So, I say, all right. So, I read a news article that said that a 12 feet crocodile was found and captured at Salt River, Clarendon, that's located within the country of Jamaica, scaring persons who are said to be swimmers. Yeah, I read a news article that said that a 12 foot crocodile, I think that should be feet, 12 feet. But, anyways, the news article said that. Uh, the news article basically said that a 12 foot crocodile had been captured at the Salt River in Clarendon, Jamaica on Sunday. 
and that uh, a certain amount of persons are persons who were swimming or enjoying themselves within the area somewhat got scared because of the crocodile that was seen there see so the news article said that a person who is said to be a member of the ccam team the caribbean coastal area management said that he was celebrating his birthday with friends and based on the news article the news article basically said that the person responded to the situation and the news article basically said that uh, the crocodile had been captured Zane. however another information from the news article basically said that uh, the ccam team or a ccam team responded to the situation and the crocodile had been captured and that the crocodile also had been processed during subscribers so the article said that someone said that we are asking people not to scale fish in the water near any swimming area to avoid attracting crocodiles to those areas normal people i did not hear that before and in my point of view this is in my point of view i think that somewhat makes sense if something have a nose and if something can taste then think about it my people so you yeah, ever find that part that's somewhat interesting, you see? So, my people, let me know what you think about uh, that whole topic right there. So, I think here's where I'm going to leave it, you know? If you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a video. Until the next time, my name is Dancer Skiller. Big up. Hey, my you, you know where you watch? Dancer Skiller!